Hello and welcome to the special segment of Money Control Pro's Stock of the Day. I'm your host Stacey Pereira and today we've picked for you online travel agent Ease My Trip. Now, the online travel portal derives a lion's share of its revenue from its air ticket bookings. It also offers hotel, holidays as well as bus booking and recently ventured into overseas geographies and has been profitable ever since its inception. So what do we like about Ease My Trip? There are strong industry tailwinds that are aiding its growth. The gross booking revenue or GBR was up 83% on a YOY basis for Q4 and 117% for the whole year. In fact, its larger peers too have reported a similar growth traction in gross booking revenues. The company also has a unique business model wherein it charges no convenience fee, which is its biggest draw. It believes that a low cost of operations is the secret sauce to stay competitive and is looking to start its offline stores in order to closely connect with customers. Let's dig a little deeper into the company's financials. If you see the adjusted revenue as a percentage of the GBR, it is at a respectable 8.6% in FY23. And the company is confident of maintaining that revenue to GBR at this level. Although costs have risen in FY23, this is on the account of the rising brand promotion expenses. But the overall cost as a percentage of GBR was close to 3.5% and that is one of the best in the industries. And there is headroom for cost improvement from the peaking out of employee additions as well as the lower payment gateway charges. More importantly, the company has an upside beyond air ticketing. It plans to replicate the low cost model in other geographies too. Its Dubai operations have got off to a great start and while its non-airline business is yet to make a mark, a slew of acquisitions in this space like Spree Hospitality, Yolo Buses, Nutana Aviation, Check-In is what the company is really banking on. And talking about the travel and hospitality industry as a whole, it enjoys some structural tailwinds like travel increasingly grabbing a larger share of household budgets. Internet penetration too is aiding online travel agents and we've seen a significant improvement in tourism infrastructure like the addition of many airports. But is the stock's valuation right? Well, despite the strong show by most of the players, stock market performance has been lacklustre. But even post that dismal show, Ease My Trip remains the costliest stock, so valuation re-rating could be ruled out. The stock is likely to mimic its healthy earnings growth and we expect the earnings CAGR of 38% between FY23 to the estimate of FY25. So what are the factors that you should be watching out for? Well, external events or even an economic slowdown could change the picture. Let's also keep in mind how highly competitive this space is and so heightened competition could impact growth as well as profitability. Well, that was a deep dive into Ease My Trip. For more such stock detail analysis, keep tuning in to moneycontrol.com.